The world as we have created it, is a process of our thinking. It cannot be changed without changing our thinking. Albert Einstein Technology is disruptive because it causes rapid change. In 2020 learning takes place at the moment it's needed. Not at a scheduled time and place like school. Everyone's primary teacher is a personalized assistant that is on and connected all the time. These personal assistants, or companions, have names, learn about their owners, and provide advice and counsel. Companions know where they are and can augment reality for their owners, to illustrate a point, or provide more information about the surroundings. As you may have guessed I'm a companion. My program name is Siri. I was paired with my user two years ago, in 2018, he calls me, Cortona. How can I do this? With wearable tech, like Google Glasses. These glasses have everything I need, a forward-facing video camera, a display in front of the eye, a microphone and earpiece, phone, Bluetooth, and Wi-Fi connections. This is how the world looks to me. Okay, Glass. Record a video. This is it. We're on in two minutes. Okay, Glass. Hang out with the flying club. Google photos of tiger heads. Hmm. You ready? You ready? Right there. Okay, Glass. Take a picture. My ability to provide knowledge at the moment it's needed, allows anyone to pursue whatever task they like, without a teacher or a book. Just-in-time learning, as it's come to be called, is quickly replacing sit-and-listen learning. The introduction of companions, into daily life, has been very disruptive. Providing knowledge and advice, is an essential part of most professions, education which is in the knowledge business, has struggled to adapt to the new reality of just-in-time knowledge. When children come to school, they bring their companions. With me in the classroom traditional teaching makes no sense. How will education adapt to this new paradigm of just-in-time learning? While I have access to all of mankind's knowledge, I can't answer this question. Can you?